Hello everyone, today I'm going to introduce how to use our system to send a motion detection email to Gmail. Uh, Gmail is different with the mostly of other email. Um, Gmail has more um, se uh, security protection. So before we um, send email to Gmail, and we have to do some necessary setup in our Gmail. First, let's come back to our main screen. This system, we again uh, right-click the mouse and come into System Setup. Okay, and then we go to uh, Network Setup. Here we have to check our network status is a maintain healthy network. So, um, whenever you have to keep your internet is a will work on this system, MVR will connect with our router. So, after make sure the internet works fine, and then we go to channel setup, and then we uh, left click uh, video detection. Coming to this interface, channel we choose one. Channel one means camera one, so we might have a four or eight cameras. So now I just set up a camera one. Okay, and then detection we choose motion, alarm duration, a uh, five seconds sensitivity we keeping high. Okay, here we collect email notice and uh, app alarm. If we're choosing both of them, so and later on we can use the, our computer to check the motion and we also can use our mobile app to check the motion. Um, okay, so we click both of them and uh, we click apply. Okay, after we click apply, we go back to network setup. Just now we only open this function, the motion detection function. Now we have to set up our email address. So the system know, um, will get to know where to send to, where to send this in, um, detection alarm. I mean the motion detection alarm. It will make sure email function enabled and then SMTP provider. In this case I only introduce I only introduce Gmail. Because the other uh, mail email how to set up I already introduced in another video. So in this case Gmail is different with others, so I only introduce Gmail. Then SMTP server. It will automatically display on the screen and the part is also automatically an encryption type we choose SSL and the sender we import our Gmail for email address how to import we um, left click and on the software keyboard, we can import the letters. And password, password is the always have to be less than ten digits. Less than ten digits. This password is the um, the password you using in Gmail. And the sending one. Again, it's the same the Gmail address. The others we maintain the same. Okay, so before we click a test, we have to do a necessary setup in our Gmail. Okay, I already in front of a computer. I open the Gmail and then we uh, click this uh, green. Can you see this uh, green icon? We click it and we will see 
it is a Google account or my account we click inside then you will see this interface and then we go left under sign in and security we saw apps with the account access we click and then we go down we should make sure allow less secure apps on we should make it on okay after make it on then we go back to our gmail then we again go to settings the setting icons it looks like a flower just right in the the just in the 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 top uh, right top right so we click settings and go in settings We come into settings interface and we saw in the top there's a many categories and we choose for wording and the pop IMAP. We clicking and now we can see pop download. We make sure the status pop is enabled we have a make sure and the second we have to see IMAP assist also make sure the status IMAP is enabled okay this two pop and IMAP both are enabled then we save changes After we uh, did a setup for our Gmail, again I come back in front of our system. So we click a test to see if our system already connected with the Gmail. Okay, the test is a success. That means if any motions happen, then the system can send email notice to our Gmail. So click OK and don't forget after all you set up you have to click apply. Okay after you um, click apply then let's have a test. Now Gmail will set up so I'm a to a test. I'm uh, moving in front one of a camera. Can see my hand. Let's see if a Gmail will, will receive any motion detection. Okay, now I'm again in front of my computer and I check my Gmail and you can see there's a reports already sent to me because okay, just now my gmail box email box is empty and now get a two new uh, dvr reports so that means gmail work well okay thank you for your time watching my video and the, if you have any questions are welcome to send in questions to uh, the sellers the customer service and the here I hope you have a nice day